Hello and welcome to Diorama Texturing Tutorial. This is the layout of our urban diorama. A fixed cardboard pieces add thickness and will help us create heaps of debris. Let's begin. We apply VMS texture number 6, yellow gravel, over our base. The gravel is saturated with VMS sand and ballast freeze. The gravel is set in place and we can continue with our diorama. We scattered some bricks over the base and add more gravel to partially bury the bricks. Again, we work with VMS sand and ballast freeze to fix the gravel in place. Let's prepare the area for our model. We apply gravel and saturate it with VMS sand and ballast freeze. We gently place the model on the wet gravel and make an imprint like so. We apply and fix some more gravel on the base. It's up to you how much ground you want to cover with debris. The debris is now frozen in place. Let's add a finer fraction over our debris to complement the terrain. We are using VMS Diorama Texture Number 10, Smooth Fine Light Sand. Again, we work with VMS sand and ballast freeze to fix our fine sand texture in place. Our structure is ready, we let it dry for 24 hours. Now we are spraying the base using a light brown color. We recommend VMS Pigment Jockey Number 1. Now we are spraying medium brown color. We recommend VMS Pigment Jockey Number 2. Let's retouch the bricks using VMS Universal Weathering Carrier. The thinner allows us to selectively remove the colors we sprayed earlier, making the bricks pop. We can also rub dry pigments here and there, 
to simulate concrete and dust in general. We recommend VMS pigment number 27. You can blend in the light gray pigment color using VMS Universal Weathering Carrier. Here we add a pinch of VMS pigment number 3 to balance the light gray color with the rest of the base. The base is ready. This concludes our tutorial. Thanks a lot for watching, hope you enjoyed it and see you next time.